What's up, chili heads? Creepy Chris once again coming at you with another hot sauce review. Sorry, Slayer, man. All right, so today we're going to be doing another sauce from Jack Jekyll. Today it will be Jack Jekyll's green sauce. All right, take a look at that bottle. Another beautiful, beautiful bottle by this company. I'm always amazed by their artwork. It's very, very beautiful. Look at that. All Dia de los Muertos. Not sure why. I, I like it. I just, yeah, it's very cool. All right. So let's check out the ingredients on this bad boy. First of all, we got jalapenos, green bell peppers, tomatillos, banana chilies, lime juice, pineapple, honey, black pepper, cilantro, dill weed, sea salt, and vinegar. Vinegar's the last um, ingredient, so it's probably gonna be minute. Some of their other sauces actually have none, which is really cool. Don't see that too often, sorry. Something in my freaking eye. All right. For a green sauce, it's actually got a really thick consistency. It's not crazy thick, like salsa or nothing. I don't know if you can see that. I'll pour it in a second for you. First, let me take a little smell here. Oh, yeah. Right away, you can smell the peppers. Tomatillo. Oh, a little bit of lime. Wow, that smells really good. Yeah. It's really, really got a nice scent. Aroma is really pungent and delicious. Oh man, oh, I can just smell that all day. But I want to taste it. So let's check out the pour on this stuff. Oh yeah. Mmm. All right, guys. Did you see that? That's beautiful. Ah, trying to avoid the crotch shots. <laughs> Whoop! Damn it. All right, here we go. Pour. I lose anymore. Jack Jekyll's green. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mmm. Right away you taste the peppers, jalapeno, mmm, tomatillo. Oh wow. It's got a really good consistency. Those those little chunks in there are just just kind of dissipate right when they hit your mouth. Wow. Flavor on that's killer. The tomatillos aren't overbearing. Sometimes they can be in green sauces, I've noticed. They can be a little bitter, but not in this one. Wow, let me try that again. You can taste a little bit of the dill, which I love too. Very, very minute, but you can taste it. All right, try that one more time. Cheers, guys. Jack Jekyll's green sauce. Mmm. Yeah, that's fabulous. Mmm. Oh wow, that would be good on anything Mexican. I mean, enchiladas, you know, tacos, anything of that sort would be really good. Um, I'm kind of getting like a... Uh, oh, you can test the, taste the black pepper, that's what it is. I was wondering what that was. It was familiar, but I couldn't put my finger on it. It's really good. Wow, so if you guys have not tried this, this is a really good green sauce. The heat, sorry, I almost forgot about that. The heat is actually... Pretty mild. You get a little bit of tongue tingle there, but it's not crazy hot. Like there's only because there's only the jalapenos and the uh, banana chilies in there, so that doesn't bring a lot of heat. But it's really, really good. This would be fabulous on like enchiladas, tacos. Like I said, oh wow. Um, you could throw this on a salad. It would just cause it's full of flavor. Just like all their sauces are just full of flavor. So all right, guys, that was my review on this sauce. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for tuning in. I'll be back again. Keep them colons blistered, baby. Out of here.